Four days later. We finished analyzing that mainframe that Mason Woods brought from Yamato. And? Perseus was looking for the names of sleepers. All right, so Perseus wanted Give us those Dragovich names. people. Last time we did the two side missions. That was very stressful. Sorry that that video, like, jumped into it. I was trying to, like, again, never played this. I'm trying to, uh, trying to, you know, make it kind of flow. Or, like, I stopped the video. There was, like, a little thing I had to quickly fix, but then it jumped into that. And, like, you like there's, like, a subtitle that's, like, not said, but it shows up on the screen. And then, like, because he goes to the next one. I was like, you can just pause it to see it. There was really... Nothing detrimental, but it was kind of just like, whoa, we're in here now. So, apologies about that. Uh, took a nice break from this. We're back. I kind of want to be. I'm, I'm here to finish the story. Oh, this is what this is what it was. So, Belikov is back in Moscow. You guys know the plan. Bell, you with me, Lazar? So that was it. It's just that the guy's back in Moscow. Are you taking him into the KGB with you? Are you crazy? Wait for Mason or Woods to return. I don't need Mason or Woods. I need Bell. He's got the skill we need. Risking the entire operation unnecessarily. It's not unnecessary. It's calculated. Just understand that if you botch this, we can't get those names. It's over. I know you can do this. Hudson doesn't trust anyone he can't control. Adler's like just a straight up Kurt Russell character in this. Oh yeah, so that was from last time. Uh, and then we cracked the code for this. We cracked the floppy disk, which was fucking stressful. And then we figured out who the three people were and we did that. It doesn't say, like, check. Like, you've done it. So, thanks for walking in front of me. But now we're here to do this one. So, desperate measures. Examine evidence. The fucking APs of evidence here? Jesus. Dmitry Belikov, the Lubyanka, the the Lubyanka building. I was like, this is KGB headquarters, and that I I'm liking that there is like subtle changes to things depending on my background. So since I'm my character's ex KGB, um, that's why he said last time that my ex KGB stuff's gonna help me do do the codes. And I wonder if that's why Hudson Wood didn't want me to go in there is because I'm KGB. Belikov will temporarily disable the camera system. Time card sheet. Russell Adler and John Bell Cunningham, with the aid of head of security Dmitry Belikov, infiltrate the Lubyanka building in hope of acquiring top secret KGB information the sleeper agent identities Perseus has found within the ruins of Yamato so I'm loving the little tie-ins we got the Lubyanka building Lubyanka KGB headquarters in Moscow the sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker your only way in or out is through this high security elevator we'll need proper credentials that's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantau. He'll do it again. This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Okay, I'm looking at, like, the level list. Like, that's how I've been trying to separate these videos, also based on, like, length. Um, but there are things, like, it's, like, level two, the CIA safe house. Like, we've, that was in the first video, is that that's, it's just us walking into the evidence room, like, to do the board and, like, select a mission. That's, like, a level. So, level we just played was the, was the briefing. But now we're on desperate measures. So, this is going a lot faster than I was expecting. Oh, I'm playing as Belikov. We're almost to the tunnels. So you get 
access to the bunker? Inspect them all. I will try. I may have trouble getting a bunker key. It could be comprom It could compromise my position. I will have a bunker key for you soon. I never let your team down. We're getting the files from that bunker. Do whatever it takes. And one more thing. One of our East Berlin informants recently switched sides and fled from Moscow. We have reason to believe he's in the Lubyanka building today. He knows too much about our Berlin network. I'm thinking of Oh, it's that guy we saved. We'll take care of it. Now I know why Hudson thinks so highly of you. We'll meet you at the basement entrance once you have the bunker key. Who is it? Amna Belikov, you've been summoned to the conference room upstairs. Secretary Gorbachev is here from the Central Committee. Wait, wait Gorbachev is here? Oh boy. General Secretary Brezhnev has taken an interest in the new security development. <laughs> Sakaev. There's a mole within the KGB. Kravchenko. The committee wants someone from the first chief directorate to oversee Colonel Kravchenko's investigation. <laughs> if you've not met him already, this is Imran Zakayev. Holy shit. Thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. And thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. I can think of no greater tragedy than... So now they've just bridged the Modern Warfare and Black Ops timelines together with Irim Zakayev now being in this universe. Not everyone shares your beauty with And also Krepchenko's alive. He survived with Woods. As head of security, I understand you've practically exhausted yourself trying to unearth this mole. How has that gone? <laughs> I am not a patient man, Bilikov, or a compassionate one. <laughs> Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Zakayev, do you have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. I also want to cultivate closer relationships with all of you. I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, Velikov? Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation? <coughs> Sound thinking, Comrade Velikov. <laughs> I would prefer it if only General Charkov retains his bunker key. So you will see to it. Worry yourself no longer, sir. I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. <clears throat> Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. <laughs> our collective, our very... It's a very nice parallel to what Kennedy says in the first Black Ops. The traitor will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. Belikov, you are dismissed. Holy shit. So now Zakayev is actually here. It's actually Imram Zakayev. Kravchenko was just here. And then Gorbachev just said the same thing Kennedy says, but a little bit turned around. That's amazing. Kind of fucked now. Use the KGB map to investigate multiple ways of acquiring a bunker key. KGB map updates with useful information as you explore, but first the map. Open the map and track the camera room. I'm being watched. I need a bunker key. Now, first, I'll have to kill the cameras. Have you ever been to a It's humbling to see 
Sir. This area is restricted. If I'm spotted so, here, I'll what can I do for you? Sorry, comrade. Now I need to hide the body. Campers are shut down, explore the map and acquire bunker key. Let Adler and his team into the building. I have to get a bunker key for Adler. I'll need it to access the vault. <sighs> Unfortunately, Cherkov now has the only one. I can meet with Charkov. Oh, I can. <clears throat> okay. Let's talk to Kravchenko. Up my mood. No matter. We've discovered additional unauthorized communications. Within hours, we will know the exact computer they came from. Comrade. Fuck. I will be exposed soon. In the server room, I could point evidence towards Cherkov. <laughs> Just to take that guy out in the middle of the room. It's a good thing we did uh, do the Modern Warfare uh, games first. Now we know who Emrim Sakaev is, if anybody needs to know. That's crazy. I was like, oh, Zakaev, like, that's interesting. And he's like, this is Imram Zakaev. I was like, oh, shit, like, it's actually him. Outside. Server switches are down for maintenance. To find Charkov. Select an active switch. Okay. 
We're switching it down for maintenance. This is a big play right here. Pull this off. Who that was real close. I got real scared about that body thing. <laughs> so I knocked that other guy out and there's no checkpoint or waypoint for him. The armory guard has a weakness for Cubans. Okay, perhaps I'd bribe to get me inside. Big plays, big plays. Mr. Kravchenko, leave evidence. Mirikov, have you dug up my mole? Cherkov, that's absurd. Where is your evidence? Right here. me. Cherkov will be passing through here soon. When he does, we will apprehend him. Oh, here he comes. That is Cherkov. General Cherkov, just how long have you been spitting on Mother Russia? Excuse me? 
Do you know who you're speaking to? I do now. Your medals will no longer protect you. Please empty your pockets on the counter. Good. Have you lost your mind? Now step over there and lift your arms to the side. You're serious? Fucking do it. Is this your way of setting up my fall? Yes, yes, yes. Once they apprehend Charkov, I'll take his body. Okay. okay. Of the Central Committee. Me too. Now go in that room without saying another fucking word. Anything else you need to tell me, you can do it in there. Okay, now I need to head to the basement and let Adler steam in. How can I help you, sir? On the gate, I'm doing security sweep. Thank you, bye. Excuse me, pardon me, pardon me, excuse me. Ah, Alex team will need many for some of their security. Luring two soldiers into the tunnel should do the trick. Delicat here, send a security detail to meet me in the furnace room. Immediately! Wasn't sure you'd come through. I don't have much choice, do I? Never me, rebel. Gives you elevated access to the bunker. What about uniforms? Shh, sounds like they're here now. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. Now, take cover. Keep it clean. Uniforms are no good to us, bloody. Tap, tap, tap. I found a door to the door. Нету никакого оправдания этой некомпетентности. У нас есть очень строгие протоколы, чтобы это предотвратить. Понятно? О, oh, nice one. Okay, I have to leave, but you should have everything you need. Now, if stopped, you are reporting to Commander Sobol. Get changed. I'm just blown away at that the detail that Irim Zakayev is here as well as Kravchenko. Our weapons and key are in the back. It's further explained. It's it is explained in Black Ops 2 how Kravchenko and Wood survive. The abridged version is that they survive. Like there's really nothing to it. Is that they just didn't die from what happened in Black Ops 1. That's crazy. Oh no, Charkov's going after him. Damn it. Damn 
Оставьте вашу сумку сюда для досмотра. Пойдем едем к Обиносте. Дайте нам пройти. Не принимайте это близко к сердцу, товарищ. У меня приказ досматривать всех, без исключения. This will be interesting. Товарищ, ты нужен за Кайву. Я разберусь. Спасибо, товарищ. О, oh мой Nice. No, it's. When did we arrive? Ah, da. Resumed. That was the wrong answer. To wash common beer. Yanya rasvisho. That's for done, yeah. It's assholes like that we gotta watch out for. I knew, I knew we were gonna get stopped in that elevator. Gear up. They won't be happy to see us down here. Wait for my word. What's interesting is they do keep it in continuity though that I'm thinking about it. Because Mason and Woods aren't here, like, because we didn't wait for them, so they don't know that Kravchenko's still alive. They don't find out until Black Ops 2. Oh, 
thank god. Actually works. Copy it to a disc. <laughs> oh, there was stuff on Dragovich in there. I'm definitely gonna have to go back and read that. there. I get the feeling we will. Let's hope so. You are surrounded. We have your friend. Got Bell and God. Time for plan B, Bell. Activate the gas. Drop your weapons and finish. Is it the gas? Okay, looks like just regular gas. I thought it was going to be Nova 6 for a second.
Tyler. <laughs> Two days later. I'm waiting for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight, Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. That was quite the adventure. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus, once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Woods. Don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my sure as shit. Guaranteed. Alright, so it looks like this would be the time to use the, um... Hold on. Make it quick, busy.
Plan A is Agent Azalea. We didn't pick Lazar for his charisma. He's an expert in bomb defusal. If it's live and he can't disarm it, you're still gonna get that nuke out of there. Bring a change of pants. Indeed it did. Our insider delivered in a big way. Yeah, definitely. The baseline expectation around here is to surpass every expectation. So from the bottom of my ass, welcome. <laughs> no problem, Hudson. Heard about Woods? Not in the business of discussing my personal views on team members to subordinates. Anything else? Should we have a larger strike team? Even at this size, Perseus could catch our scent on the wind and try to relocate. In this scenario, less is more. Alright, I gotcha. It's as good as it's gonna get. The intelligence community has spent years trying to track Perseus to a concrete location. This guy lives between the lines of recorded history. Nothing would put a bigger smile on my face than you personally putting him down. Thanks for your time. In the back corner if you need to go over any details from the briefing. Talk to Woods and Mason. Hey, Mason. Looking good. Look alive. It's Adler's protege. Well... Some issue between you and Castro? Are you fucking serious right now? Don't get him started. Nah, 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 nah. Hold on, let me set the record straight. Here we go. <laughs> so yeah, Castro and I have some history between us. I had the opportunity to off the man, but our intel was flubbed. That's in a tidal wave of shit all the way up to DC. So if I find out that Perseus is in cahoots with Castro, and Hudson happens to find one of my bullets in Fidel's head, well. I say chalk it up to collateral damage. Huh. Kept it under five minutes. I was expecting a diatribe. No, we were after a different spying case, huh? Huh, that's right. Our team was right next to Adler's when we touched down in Way City. That's also the first time I had the misfortune of meeting Hudson. Yep. <laughs> in all those years, nothing's changed. He still has the personality of a wet fucking blanket. You guys are legends, and it is an honor to serve with you. <laughs> you hear that? We're fucking legends. Yeah, wherever we go, we bring the thunder. Man, get the fuck out of here with that shit. You seem pretty unimpressed over in Fake Town, USA. Or, are you talking about Mason right now? As I live and breathe. Yeah, well, you just snuck into the KGB with Adler, packed their database, and got out in one piece. And I'll be going in with my boy here. If I were Perseus, I'd be running for the hills. And I'd be calling in a mortar strike on that hill. You got a point in saying that? You sound concerned too. If you're trying to be friendly, this is the dumbest way to go about it. Uh, We're just fucking with you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he should be concerned. <laughs> yeah, for Adler, it's a culmination of three decades of meticulous tracking. He'll probably be extra pissy on this mission. I advise you to stay focused and drop the nostalgia. Good. Then you're ready. Later, guys. Later, Bell. Doing some secret shit in there. Oh, end of the line. Are we gonna get that nuke back from Perseus? And this seems like it might be near end game stuff. So that's gonna be for next time.